My name is Josh Jones, and I just recently moved out here from Northwest Colorado. I uh, spent five years there, and before that I was in uh, Alabama for about 30 years. In Colorado, I was the director of Parks and Recreation for a small little town just west of Steamboat Springs, a community of about 2,000 people. And I was offered this opportunity to come to a somewhat larger community to continue my profession as uh, director of Parks and Recreation. So that was the initial interest uh, in this opportunity to come to Berwick. I've never been to this region of the country before, so it was a sight unseen um, decision that we made. Uh, my dad was Air Force, so we've traveled all over the country, but never came here. So that was a big reason uh, we wanted to, to be chosen New England area. Um, get our kids more athletic opportunities, more academic opportunities than we had in our small little community. Professionally, I see lots of uh, areas for improvement in the uh, open spaces. Um, I'd like to continue the growth out at Memorial Field with the feasibility study that was just recently done. I'd like to honor um, some of the requests in that study um, by making improvements to the turf, uh, the facilities. Um, I'd like to see uh, that space grow with the addition of the full basketball courts. Um, I think there's going to be a tennis court and a pickleball conversion opportunity. There's a batting cage up there um, and field work to the fields have, all, have already started to the baseball fields. Um, just got to continue to manicure that, that open space and let it be the open space that the community just brags about and loves. Some of the events that are coming up first, um, Easter and then summer camps are coming up so we're organizing um, the, the schedule for the summer camps which is a big deal, a seven week um, summer camp. We get lots of kids involved and uh, we go, all, go to places all over this region which I'm going to go on because I haven't seen any of these places that were taking these kids. So I'll be chaperoning um, as much as I possibly can. Uh, we have this enrichment, empowerment, girls on the run that's coming up and I think so, registration starts in March. It's a, it's a running program that really hones in on the empowerment of third through fifth graders. Um, and then they end their season with a run somewhere in Maine that I don't know the, the location of that race yet. Um, and then our Easter event we'll have up at Memorial Field. Um, we'll hopefully have a good turnout, bring the community up there and let the little ones run around and find the, the eggs that are well hidden in the grass. <laughs> uh, what's finishing up right now is the basketball program, the travel and the recreational. Um, their season is winding down. I, I do have experience working with the school district. Um, we had some land that was on their property, so we did have to get permissions from the athletic director and the superintendents. I do have experience working with the coaches um, from the school district in Colorado. Um, they would also seek permission to use our property. We had a large open space with a playground uh, pretty much across the street. So we worked together to host as many of their athletic events that spilled over from their football field over to our green spaces. And we did have the, uh, the championship football game uh, for our little kids. Our Doak Walker fifth and sixth grade football team got to play under the lights on a brand new stadium and run through paper and uh, artificial turf field. It was a really special moment for those kids. I'd like to wrap this up by saying thank you to everybody that has welcomed me into this community and my family. And my door is always open. I know I have a lot of people yet to meet and I look forward to having those conversations with everybody. So you can always find me here at my office at Town Hall uh, if you've ever got a question or want to talk about anything. You can email me at recdirector at berwickmaine.org.